India Pak have Mo Yuong Carta per as per it passport is needed. MEA Ministry of External Affairs. Mayor, spokesperson Ravish Kumar on Thursday said, We have an MOU with Pakistan. It hasn't been changed. An as per it passport is needed. For Carter Per. Quote, Reports coming in from Pakistan are conflicting about passport requirements, Kumar said. We think there are differences between their foreign office and other agencies, he added. Trolling after my praise will test your meditation skill. PM to U.S. billionaire after U.S. billionaire Ray Dalio praised PM Narendra Modi. PM Modi replied to him saying, The trolling after these words of praise would give you the best opportunity to test your Meditation skills and being like a ninja. Dalio had shared a video of his interaction with PM Modi and called him one of the best leaders in the world. Have not revised boundary. India on Nepal's objection to new map. Ministry of External Affairs spokesperson Ravish Kumar on Thursday responded to Nepal's objection on Kalapani area being shown as part of India in new. Political map. Our map accurately depicts the sovereign territory of India. It has in no manner revised our boundary with Nepal, Kumar said. The boundary delineation exercise with Nepal is ongoing under existing mechanism, he added. He added, Pact charge $20 fee on Kartapur corridor opening day. Report Pakistan has told India that Indian pilgrims visiting Gurdwara Darba Sahib. Pakistan through the Kartapur Corridor will have to pay $20 fee on its opening day. A PTI report said, Pakistan PM Imran Khan had earlier said pilgrims won't be charged the fee on the opening day. The corridor is being opened to mark Guru Nanak Deb's 550th birth anniversary. Pak displays bomb at Kartapur Gurudwara says IAF dropped it in 1971 ahead of the opening of Kartapur Corridor. Pakistani authorities have created an exhibit at Darba Sahib Gurdwara featuring a bomb, which they claim was dropped on the shrine by Indian Air Force in 1971. The bomb has been placed within a glass case. A signboard near the bomb reads that IAF dropped it with the aim to destroy the shrine.